Hello. <coughs> How we doing? Welcome back. So I thought I had something stuck to my map then. How we doing? If you just joined, welcome. If you was here for part one, welcome back. Hope the AV's working, seems to be. So yeah, after a flying an Apache chopper, it's time to tackle some vomiting people. Smooth transition. Where's Sommy? What's he doing? Right, let's drug Sommy down. He's going to be playing again today. Ha! Hello. We have a choice. Ooh. We have a choice of three. Not to mention the DLC, but I thought we'd finish this first, right? I think that sounds wise, don't you, sir? We've got the Happy Cow Harbour. We've got the Highway Hijinks. And we've got the Coastal Canyon. I think we ought to do the, the happy harbour and not jump ahead of ourselves progression-wise. All right. Mr. Hamley, thank you for 19 months. PJ51, NXN66, Bidfoot with 56, and the boy with 22. Thank you. What was the driving game with the strong knees guy? Mamba Zoo. Strong knees? Mamba Zoo. Yeah, but where's the strong knees reference? Maple from? syrup guy, and there's the guy, uh, Mr. Bonjour, that runs up oh, and down the main road, isn't it? Yeah, that's Mamba Zoo. I was thinking about the driving position, like strong knees. I was trying to work <laughs> out what, what, what driving game is like that. I, I was only going by um, the. He was asking because of the intro. So it's on the intro, isn't it? Which is why um, he asked. I think was how I got there quicker. Thank you, Benno. 69 months. Right. Happy Co Harbour, you say? Yeah. How was lunch? I had a ham, cheese, and tomato sandwich. And oh, that was me thinking you were going to do like baked beans on toast. Nah. Ham, cheese, and tomato sandwich. Packet of crisps and a yogurt. You're stopped for the, the, the stress of uh, Park Tech, then. Chill out with some Park Tech, yeah? After flying the Apache, yes. I mean, to be honest, I don't feel... I mean, we did this was it last week or the week before. When we did the Hind, I really felt like we needed to do Park Attack after because it was just a nice, like, de-stress. Yeah. I don't feel as stressed as I did last week, funnily enough, you know? Yeah, I mean... Yeah, it's, it's the right amount of concentration required. Hmm. Thanks, 43 months, Trucker Jet. I love him and cheese, please. All <laughs> D-Storm. Um, right, it says company has plans to use the site to showcase new attractions. So be sure the guests don't get to see all the old industrial structures. Okay. Oh, cool. Invitation does not revoke contracts obligations. Blah, 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 blah. Three coasters in your park. Excitement rating of 50. 80% decorations, 600 guests. Optional, May year three. Okay. This could be interesting. Some. Let me give that a name. Let me give that an obvious password. Uh, let me tick that box and that box, and let me click. Was that obvious for the password? Very obvious. Okay, I'll put obvious for the password. Well, you spell it wrong because it's very obvious. Oh, I got it wrong. Right, let me so pause it's very obvious. Oh, I didn't do the very. Oh, okay. <laughs> Blimey. Um... This really is a harbour. Okay, so what? Is this the park entrance, like here? Deliveries. So that's a massive depot. Yep. Can you see any other given facilities? Nope. Because I do not. I There's, also, nothing. There's nothing on the list. 
I also say only 20 grand. Yeah, I mean, this is like the, the expansion area, so... Okay, that's broken again. Every now and again, I think, I swear it's GoXLR or OBS or one of the two. It just, you can't adjust the volume. It's just gets stupid. Dutch TS. <laughs> that was loud. I know what I can't turn it down. I, mean, I, I think you should get on that. Thank you so much for gifting yet another 20 subs. Pretty certain you did that at the start of the last stream. Thank you very much. And if you got a sub, please give him a thank you, guys. I wonder if I bounce my GoXLR. Are you serious right now? I don't know. I mean, it's a real pain. Please bear with us, viewers, as Paul completely loses his voice. Or can you imagine if everybody started gifting 20 subs all day long? <laughs> oh, no, I, I don't disagree with your concept. I'm just a <coughs> brave man. It would be terrible. The noise would be unbearable. Um, I can't remember what I did to fix it last time. Either bounce go XLR or bounce OBS. I think you bounced you go XLR if I recall. Yeah. That one. Yeah, you see, it's misbehaving. Right, I have bounced it. Right. As to whether it fixes it, I don't know. Okay. I mean, I control the game audio. So that's a winner. Right, what have we got then? We have Observation Tower. That's not bad. Five thrill rides. Steel coaster and a wooden coaster, so that's good. Transport, blah, blah, blah. Shops, we have quite a nice selection. I think the problem we're going to face here is money. In yeah, in and a room. little bit of space as well. <laughs> and all those decorations are nasty. Especially some of the cranes and stuff. <laughs> like real high-rise cranes that need to be blocked off somehow. Yeah, that's painful. Onamichi, thank you for gifting five mm. subs. Welcome, guys. Thank you. Thanks for the squirrel gifts this morning, this afternoon even. Losing track of time. Don't forget, clocks go forward an hour tonight in Europe. Don't forget that. Especially if you live in the States. Yeah, you forgot Because the stream the will week. jump an hour. You can't delete them. Hmm. Uh, <laughs> I mean, you know. No. You can't delete them. Well, they're not in park boundaries, are they? That's true. They're undeletable. Bah, 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 bah. Do you know, I really wanted to. That was good. Come on. <laughs> The things you say. <laughs> he's, he's, uh, <laughs> undeletable. Oh. <laughs> Jack Sims. How are you doing, sir? Thank you for 89 months. Um, The line here, is that a purchase boundary? Yes. That is what I feared. So we've got to buy all of that. Oh, I just click things. Oh, rip. Do you want to reboot the session, Paul? I literally held control click and did that, and it went ahead and bought stuff. Like, how dumb is that? How much did I just spend on that? Like a grand? There you go. <laughs> That's whew, seven grand to buy that bit. We didn't need to do that, though, yet, did we? No, we didn't, Paul. Why don't you do it, then? Because you'd already spent three grand. Do you want to restart the session? Probably a good idea. <sighs> One sec. Oh, dear. 
Right, that one, that one. Right. What was it? Very. Uh, what was it? Very. Very obvious. Very obvious. Thing. Okay, we need some kind of a plan here because we don't have a lot of space. And this is literally the only space we have in the entire map. And we have to build three roller coasters. Is this for real? Yep. How can you build three roller coasters in that land? You're not thinking fourth dimensionally. You're right, I'm not. Three coasters of excitement rating of 50. They're going to be very small coasters. I, I don't know about you, but this feels like a big challenge. Mr. D-Storm. I don't think I managed to make that quieter, but it felt a little bit quieter. Thank you so very much, D-Storm, for 20 subs gifted. Lots of resubs, plenty of new guys. Welcome, or welcome back. And if you got a sub, D-Storm is the person to thank. Thanks for the score gifts, D-Storm. I guess rebooting GoXLR didn't do anything then. I give up. <laughs> um... I give up. Do I... you want to put a central catering area, but we'll, have, we'll call this the centre for when we possibly buy this bit? Sounds... One second. Oh, sorry. I'll let you do some technical stuff. Yeah, I'm just trying to figure out why that's doing that. Please bear with us, viewers, while Paul Trust fixes his stream. Definitely correct. Everything's set correct, so I don't get it. <clears throat> it doesn't say how big it has to be. So if we make a do circle. you want to do a test? If you can get excitement 50, see yeah. if you can pull your slider back quickly. No, I just pulled it back while the D storm thing was in the middle of playing, and it didn't make any difference. Hmm. So I'm very confused. What else is on that channel? Just the alerts. Anything OBS outputs, it should be going through that. Right. Um, yeah, so if I do a, a test out, out through the system channel like I just did, I should be able to slide up and down and change it, but I can't. Weirdly. Yeah, that didn't, that seemed to not change. That was just same level for me anyway. That's the music out, which is what OBS plays. So anything oh. OBS should go out of that channel, which definitely can be slid down. Right. Yeah, that was so, that had that had a uh, volume change in it. That last one. Yep. And that's what it should be doing. Lord Bongo, thank so you for seventy-two months. So is that not Streamlabs then? No, you know, because you're saying that's part of that output. Yeah. So OBS captures it from Streamlabs and then plays it out through the music out channel, which is on a slider. That's how it should work. And the, and I've just tested the music channel slides. So I don't get it. Probably needs mm -hmm. OBS to be bounced. Something stupid like that. Possibly. Audio. Yeah, it's definitely set correctly. Right, we need to plan. How are we going to build three roller coasters on a postage stamp? Okay, and we can't terraform either.
you. They literally removed the terraforming tools, didn't they? Yep. I guess the excitement then is to go very high and then drop them. Turn a corner and come back to start. Like, literally, that's the only thing that's going to work. Yeah. And we've got to do it with 17... Where's three grand gone? Depot and staff room. Oh, my God. This is tricky. All right, so we've got a footpath perimeter, haven't we? So we've got to work to that, I guess. Um, How do you want to do it? Shops in the middle? Yeah, that was where I was going with this. But I was doing it... I'm assuming that we can actually build... Um, yeah, pathways like that. So I was just going by the concept that... Um, Wow, we're going to, have to be very economical. Yeah, none of your double path nonsense. Well, loans aren't the issue, correct. Um, okay, what are we going to do? Decoration rating of 80%. Oh, my God. 600 guests in this area. Are you kidding me? Just from that alone, we'll need a decent amount of um, pavement. That <coughs> so these aren't being affected by any of this. Although it says visible sources of bad decoration rating. Oh, that's hilarious. If you're in the decoration visualization and you build a footpath, it doesn't show it as being bad. It doesn't show it as red, but if you hover over it, it says there's definitely a debuff. If you turn yeah. off and on decorization, It'll then you see it. On. Yeah. <laughs> I have to spend a fortune just on fence panels. Fences. Let's get some of them going. Yeah, I don't think fence panels are going to cut it. Really? Why not? Because these structures are tall. Yeah, you build tall fence panels. Uh, do they actually visually do anything? I don't know. Or we'll try it in a sec. Apparently not. Well then. <clears throat> you can place this scenario by only building on the grassy part, so it's definitely possible. You just need to be creative with space. Yeah, I believe that. Roof shapes. Let's see what we got. Walls. Invisible wall. That's glass by the looks of it to me. It says wall. It literally says wall on it. Wall curved, wall diagonal, wall. Does not say glass. How strange.
Luckily, these things are only like a fiver each. There you go. That's fine. It's going to be like that <clears throat> just to get it so that by the time you can see the tower you're too far enough away for it to be bothered effectively do you know if you put the park under a roof you wouldn't have a problem with rain anymore why won't you build in a line How do you drag this wall out? Because if you drag it, it starts rotating it. Yeah, I don't think you can. There we go. <clears throat> Space Dogs, thank you for four years. Well, almost 47 months. Yeah, with most things, you like fences and stuff or hedges, you just drag them out. For some reason, with the wall, you can't. Apache calamities. What are you talking about? There's only a calamity for the enemy. I'd already fixed that. What do you mean? I'd already done the this side and changed the wall oh, out. You put the wall in? Yeah. <laughs> I'll get a refund then. <laughs> right so any of the path that i then put down didn't um have decoration debuff so enough all right save that cool <laughs> cool so that's five grand gone we're not even built a ride yet <laughs> so what are we thinking having a seating area here in the middle somewhere oh yeah yeah i mean i've put a well, what I would refer to as a small central hub, but yeah, but we've got to put seats in somewhere. Unless we nick land up over here for seats. Yeah, if you want to, because you know it's all reclaimed space then. 
do something like that and put a lot of seats down. So put the shops on this side first. Then put curbs in with a C. Curbs with a C. Benches, go with that style. No excuse for littering, TM. You cannot terraform on a Michi. If you look, terraforming tools have all been disabled completely. So we can't reclaim any land. We, we can only build on that land and that land and nothing else. And we've got to build three roller coasters. With 20 grand. So yeah. Not exactly a straightforward one, this is it. And to keep the decoration level up, we'll have to make money. So we're going to need something that's going to make us good money to kick us off with. That decision will be critical. It's got to be a coaster. Trouble is, any coaster that's pre-made is pretty unlikely to just fit straight in. Like that one would be that area there like that. That's an eight grand purchase. You're looking at the steel, so. I, I just picked the first steel one, yeah. Beach club we've had before, that's a nice. Is it grand. Excitement 50 is the spec, isn't it? Uh, yeah, excitement, excitement 50, but decoration of the park has to be 80. Jackhammer could work from the wooden coaster. <clears throat> How much is a jackhammer? Nine, eight, six. So it's eight, six, and it has high, low, very low. The blue steel has very high, medium, low, and costs less money. Is it better stack? It's a, high, a very high, medium, low. Oh, versus, this is a high, low, very low. Yeah. So it's a medium intensity. So yeah, go with that as well, though. What? Which one? The blue? Yeah, blue the blue. Let me just check the rest. Extreme, medium, low. Green Hill costs more money, but is infinitely more compact. And Green Hill What's... is an extreme, medium, low. Do that then. So then it comes down to orientation. Like, do we... <clears throat> do we tuck it in? I would almost be tempted to run it lengthways between there and there. It works better if you have it this way around. But it's just a matter... I, I take it it's got cues inside. I would assume you need to put it the other way around so that the buildings are closest to the shops. That's going to be the entrance, I would say. Well, if you spin it that way, then you you then have to uh, put it there. Which well, seems to put the trees over the footpath, so you'd have to have it there. The, the, this grey is not a footpath, it's just scenery. Okay, well in that case, that would be the... So do you no. want to shove it in, do you want to put the far corner in this corner then? For space reasons. It's not as good as you think when it's this way around, that's the point. 
that's as close as you can get it in either direction. Because if you go that way, it goes red. And if you go that way, it goes red. So that's that. So... It's to do, do with the legs coming off the top coast a bit, if you see it. Right, so do you want to put it the other way around then? But then bring... Well, if you go, if you go that way around, you can get to the... Oh. So I've got an idea. So the, 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 what, the orientation that you've got it at the moment... Bring it this way as far as the current boundary is. That's literally what I started with, and you said, yeah, but the problem with that is it's facing away from the shops. No, that's fine, but bring <laughs> overhang it on the water. You want to keep coming out this? Uh, yeah. That's the maximum. Yeah, and then is it as far up this way as you can? Uh, it will go to there, but you won't be able to walk down that outside. Yeah, you will, because I think that's footpath, that wooden stuff on the outside. Okay, you want to go there? That's 11 grand. Yeah. What? That's 11 grand? It's 11 two. Uh, it costs more money because we're overhanging. It only costs 10.9 when we're here. So I think it must have to build some other structures because here it's 10.9. Okay. On the template, when I hovered over it, it said 8,900 approximate cost. But when I go to put it down, oh, that was Green Hill, wasn't it? Approximate cost 10,900, which is what it is there. But it is more expensive when we go like that. It's now 11,2. So it's 300 <coughs> more to put it where we want it. Yes. Then do that. Um, there's a 6, 7, 14, and 21 loan in the bank. Good, because we'll be needing it. Um, three point eight percent. Fight your urge, Paul. Fight the urge. Brutal, mate. Brutal. Well, Fight the let's urge. Take the fourteen. And leave it oh, there. he's done it. He couldn't just go full money. He had to do it. We get better <laughs> deals than that. <laughs> Super Al, thank you for nine months. Mark Sterling, thank you for 63. Do you, do you have nightmares welcome. and you just go, no, interest, no. No, interest, no. Listen, when I watch TV and I see those adverts for like Wonga and they go APR 1,200%, I die a little inside. So, do you think they can actually get into that? <laughs> Not currently, I'm working on it. Because that seems very crushed. Like everybody's going to come walking down there. Yeah, that's pretty much the idea. Have you not seen him slacking? Because the payday loan companies, right? The idea is that you get a short term loan. So you borrow like £200 and you pay back £270 two weeks later. If you then scale that up to the APR, so if you borrowed the money, the equivalent APR, and they have to tell you on the screen legally, APR like 1,000 something percent. It's shocking. The underwater exit. Yeah. Okay, we've got the shops, we've got the coaster. Um, do we want some thrill rides, maybe? Stick down a Dave's Dremel Enterprise and... Um... A Dave's Dremel Enterprise. An ancient technology tower thing. That was exactly the one I was looking for. Go on, then. Oh, geez, that's actually quite a lot. I think that's the footprint of that is huge. Rocky Tower is a bit smaller, I think. Okay. Yeah, the footprint of that is at least as big as our plaza. It's like a bit bigger, whereas the Rocky Mountain is... Yeah, I'm just thinking chunky about the, square the, smaller. the added decoration effect, but yeah, go for that. Uh, do you want to face it in then, like this? Yeah. Tuck it but into the corner. Keep it near the edges, yeah. Okay. 
Okay, they can't walk around the perimeter now. <clears throat> you better look at the prices and open the park up, mate. We are charging nothing to get in. Cool. Sounds good. Yeah. Yeah, if you want to do it that way. I mean, I'm just saying that's where it started on. Oh, okay. Right. That it's not what we have to keep it. I on. thought that was a statement. Sorry. Let's try $5. Uh, have you edited this for cameras and stuff? Uh, no, I have not. Right, I'll edit the coaster now. You were going to put one there. <laughs> <laughs> uh, two trains. It's going to be hard to squeak anything more into that. It's such a short track. You set the price on the food? Yeah, I tweaked them a little bit. <laughs> Don't we want to sell pizza, uh, shirts and candy? Well, when we stopped talking about it, it was due to the money issue, so I'd stopped putting shops down because it was our last grand, but that was before we took a loan, so... Okay. This editor, editor's rubbish, like, you highlight it, so when you type, it should remove it, and it just... Oh, it does now. You scan back. When I did it that way before... Okay, whatever. Whatever, game. There you go. Just did it again. It's a prison. It's a prison that you pay to get in. Four dollars for a shirt. That's cheap. Two mechanics. We need two mechanics so early. Oh, they weren't meant to be mechanics, they were meant to be haulers. Yeah, I'm in Apache I, I, mode, sorry. I fixed that up already. Cool, good. No, I, 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 I did two haulers, so... I was, meant, I was meant to do two haulers, but clearly they were mechanics. Well, you hired mechanics and didn't set the zone either. I wasn't going to bother with the zone at this stage, but... You created the zone? 
Yeah, but they were there. You distracted me, alright? It's all your fault. We always put holes in a zone. Don't give me that. Yeah, but... Yeah. <laughs> Is there a footpath to the rides and the food court? There's a footpath to here, which then goes around to that and then goes to here. Personally, I would have probably put something across here. But... See, that's not a path, is it? That's not a pathway. You could probably texture that out because it's a bit confusing. Right, Bruce, he got through the door and got fired. It's outrageous. comes a rain. <clears throat> well, it was minus five earlier, so that's not too bad. We got an umbrella shot. Negative. Yeah, we will on Amici, but right now we just need to get... The, the, the biggest problem right now is not decoration, it's money. We need to start making a profit. ASAP. said the park entrance fee was a good deal. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny they should say that because it just went up. Wow. Scumbag. Um, we've got some decoration issues here. <laughs> the irony there is we just got an award for decoration. I know. What, so they want walls along there as well? Apparently they do. Keep going all the way at the entrance. Welcome to prison land, we should call it that. <clears throat> Something like that, Poil, but then the counter to it is you don't get as much of a problem with vandalism. And the vandals break things and affect the part ratings and stuff. So they're really annoying. Park of Missions, 254. Starting to get some money from rides now.
<clears throat> Dutch Foxy, thank you for almost three years. Gone off rise for now, do you think? Hmm. Might be able to squeak an observation tower there. Yeah, sounds good. Or a launch drop tower, depending on what we, what we want to go for. Car more thrill. It's too expensive with all the decoration. <laughs> Are they going to be bothered if they go in the observation tower and they can see right over into the industrial bit? I don't know that we'll get the measure for that. The problem with this is, like, if I put it up against the wall, it's unlikely we can build something else here. Let's do some colours. There you go, that's obnoxious. To just the ride height. How? How do you just the ride height on this thing? I don't think you can. I can't open it because I need to adjust the ride height, but I can't adjust the ride height. Better? How? I don't know. I managed to. <laughs> I clicked on it and the arrow to make it go up and down. That's just it? so weird. <laughs> you know the host doesn't get to see the right thing. I didn't even have rotor blades, mate. I think you've got problems. Law. The coast only just makes a leap. This one? Oh, you mean this? Huh. Close the setting menu and open it. You think it's a bug? Okay. I just heard somebody throw up then. operating at a loss. Yeah, do you think they're enjoying their observation? We're hardly making any money from food drink. Six pizzas. Six soft drinks. What's going on? Well, they're not hungry or thirsty yet. The soft drink is really worth the money, they say. Look at all this.
This sure I'm not found. Thank you so much for 86 months. That's longer than many marriages. Lol. Fried Camel, thank you for 11. Um, Dutch Foxy, thank you for 35. I was looking to see which mods were in chat. I was going to call it like Papa something. Papa Mad South African. There you go. Papa Mad South African pizzas. Who's the mo who's the other mod in chat? Where are you? Where are you? Trucker J, I think. Trucker J. So, uh, soft drink. Mm. Iron J. How about that? Iron Dre. I I enjoy I enjoy soft drinks. Moto Junkie, thank you for 14 months. You better put pep, plenty of pepperoni on those, Chris. Somebody's been vandalizing our park. Yeah, I did hear um, there was a I'm banned uh, sad face, but. <clears throat> Sam Black, sure, thank you, 57 months. Financially, this is not doing great. That's all right. We only lost $26 last month. It's making a very slow start. Pineapple and pizza should be illegal. I don't mind pineapple on pizza. Like, ham and pineapple's fine. It's no different to gammon and pineapple, but not on pizza. I'm more worried about people who put artichokes on pizza. I'd say that should be illegal. Matlin Zofi, thank you for seven months. if you can get some more money. It's just an underwater footpath, Andy. Mr. Altenor, thank you, 33. A tandoori pizza. I'm not sure how I feel about a tandoori pizza. I, don't, I really don't know. People are buying more stuff now, I think. It sounds like it. Like you say, I think just everything was on a bit of a slow start, you know? genuinely zoomed into the shops then and like what the hell was that <laughs> hey we made 624 last month are you happy yeah. now well i did put the ticket price up hmm. my thinking is if you cover the seating areas near the shops then in theory when it rains people will flock to that area yeah, well, remember on the snow one, I completely enclosed the whole shops, didn't I? I put yeah. a roof on the whole thing. <clears throat> Yay, positive income, hype. Won't last. 
God, I'm so tired. I've had a bout of about eight yawns in the last five minutes. It's ridiculous. Oh. I'm living on virtually no sleep right now. Yeah, I just... Maybe I should have made a cup of tea in the break. I made a coffee just before the start of the stream. A posh coffee or normal? No, normal. I, got I didn't have time for a posh no. coffee. Just literally an instant. Got that beautiful coffee machine and you have instant. What Why? a sacrilege. I know. I'm not paying that much for a park entrance fee. I'll drop it by a dollar. And then tell them to shut up. Two people. I'm not paying that for a park entrance fee. They're such whiners. Whiners, whiners, little, little whiners. Right, let's change the colour. Um, I think your queue for the observation tower needs to be slightly longer. Why? Because I think it can hold more than 21 people. Okay. I'm not sure how many it can hold, but I think it can definitely hold more than 21. Do you want me to just deal with that if you're doing something else? Yeah, but don't remove the upright from the coast a bit. Okay. Because it just looked nasty. Did you use the standard queue, but just with the colour picked from the <clears throat> tower? If you just do do the uh, eyedropper on that floor tile for the queue, it'll just pick up the pattern. Okay. People can go in this one. Oh, <laughs> that messes it up. Uh, isn't it 12 at a time on that? So that should be enough then. Yeah. Vandals, I just heard one. Support, slow down. Whoa! Got scumbags, have we? I literally heard like four things crash. Our seating area is demolished. Is it? Great security guard. Wow. Well, we did make a profit. <sighs> you literally can't get the staff, can you? You've had your ride, have you, mate? There you go. You can get off now, then. Bye bye. Thank you very much. Oh, two of them are on the observation tower. Here's one. Wait, he's not got a beard on my screen. Maybe I picked the wrong one. Hang on. I want a refund. There you go. There's two of them. Were there? I've done like eight at least. 
Yeah, we had a security guard, which is insane. Can we make that bigger? Three remain. That's annoying. Okay. Yeah, all gone. Yeah. <clears throat> Somebody on the radio mentioned Steel Coaster. Hey, Grumpy. You're doing fine. We're researching coasters again. We haven't had one yet. Which normally brings in more money between like a twister and a star shape or a graviton? Um, basically the, the ones that provide the highest, you know, excitement and intensity, really. There's currently a 14 grand loan for 2.2%. Did you want to take the 14 and then repay the 2.7% that we've got at the moment? Why not? Do you want to research next? Well, I mean, it's dependent on whether you think we... I kind of want to get a coaster down. Another coaster down. Well, we've got three coaster types now. So I think we should do shops. Get the money. Yeah. Bobble tea. Bobble tea is always an earner. In the hydraulically launched coasters, there's one I quite fancy the look of. It's the Celestial Palace that looks awesome. How much? 17 grand. Yikes! <clears throat> we don't have medieval structures, so it would be missing some stuff. And yeah, it was properly big. The money that we're missing makes it 16. The footprint is an issue. Need to wait for the loan system to refresh because there isn't anything on offer at the moment. The space one just about fits. Right. Like literally just fits in <laughs> the space. Okay. Do that one then. <laughs> well, we don't have the cash for it. Right. Okay. So we're going to put the space one in here, yeah? It would fit. Okay, just waiting for the right loan then, yeah? Wait, what? When did I do that? <laughs> Scumbag? <clears throat> did nobody actually notice that? 
It's very, very high intensity. I think we've only got extreme. Halfway through year one. Nearly halfway there. I did not do it. I, to be honest, Poil, if I'd have thought of it, I would have done it, but I didn't. Not on that occasion. Another month of fun and games out, so thank you. I wonder what they think when they come off this ride. It's awesome, it's too intense. Nobody complaining about prices. They think that that was a really good deal. Mr. Hemelson, thank you very much for your raid. Welcome, guys. Thank you. Hope you had a good stream. raining umbrella sales let's have a look so we've sold 13 so far supply and demand price just went up That's curious. When I bring up the rain protection overlay, those umbrellas do not show us rain protection. No, I don't think they do. I think it's the only the pavilions that provide rain protection. I mean, that is somewhat misleading. Mm -hmm. The bank loan system has refreshed and they are a load of garbage. <laughs> I, if you look into the pavilions, it doesn't make any distinguish, distinguishing like stats between any of them over rain protection. No, but I know that the top left, the middle, and the bottom left work. That is a con. Oh, wow. You can't even put them... No, I give up. They don't even snap properly on the grid. Yeah, they, they, they should all offer rain protection. <clears throat> hmm, that's frustrating. I've noticed it gives you a mini monorail uh, freebie. So that would get people from one side to the other, because there's no other way of doing it. Yeah, I don't think there's enough room for that, is there? There's not, like, there's not any requirement. It's only like 20 squares across, isn't it? Well, you'd either have to underground pathway or shuttle them over.
Please, Mr. Boat Manager, can we have some better loans? Um, Crav, it's kind of like... I can explain this. It's some kind of industrial wasteland. It's by the harbour. Um, but the stipulation is that the guests don't want to see all this industrial nasty stuff. So you have to put these fence panels up to block the view. And then it only gives you this block of land, plus this block of land, and you have no terraforming tools. So you can't terraform across any of this. The only way to link this to that, after you've bought this, is either a monorail or a footpath. So, you know, but you can build footpaths, okay, but you can't build anything else on here, really. Apart from uprights, I guess. Well, we made 1100 last one. That's more like it. And that's with... Oh, you dropped the research. Yeah. So do you want to take a 10 grand loan and pay back the 14? At 1.7? Uh. Um. I kind of need money, though, to buy another coaster. kind of need a bigger loan more than we need a lower interest rate. I wish you could actually research so that you could at least unlock another loan or something. Or when your park's reputation is high enough, you can take another loan out. Have you seen the planet? Crafter game, no? What's that? Oh, I got really confused a second ago. Papa, <laughs> mad South African, it's what you call pizza plates. Where's the cash coming in from? Oh, IMJ is making the money. Thousand dollars. Papa, mad South African, not even making half. Drop Tower makes reasonable money, the Observation Tower is rubbish, and the coast is bringing in seven grand. <coughs> Space Builder, where the goal is to terraform an entire planet for human habitation. Let's have a quick look on Steam. What's it called? Planet Crafter. Planet Crafter, planet Crafter and Planet Crafter Prologue 3. Very positive. Space survival open world terraforming crafting game. Transform the ecosystem of a hostile planet to make it livable for humans. Survive, collect, build your own base, then create oxygen. Single player only. Subnautica in space, somebody said. The basic gameplay loop is reminiscent of Subnautica, somebody says. Gather resources, build a base, explore, upgrade gear to explore further, and make more and more basic needs automatic. The difference, terraforming. It's a dead planet, you'll be working to make a, uh, a habitual, including water and planet life. No combat. There's no wildlife to try and eat you. This can be considered plus or minus depending on the player.
Somebody played it for 0.4 hours, downvoted it, and said, Glorified Arcade Walking Simulator. Walking Simulator, no automation. How would they know, after playing it for less than 30 minutes, that there was no automation? How would they know that? Unsatisfactory endgame, literally no challenge. How would you... What? How can you say things like that when you played it for 0.4 hours? <laughs> Honestly, you shouldn't be able to write a review unless you've played something like an hour minimum. And even then, people should be able to like downvote stupidity. No, there's literally no endgame, Biff. That's what you said. There's literally no endgame. Right, I'm going AFK to make a tea. Okay, nope. Because I can't stay awake. <laughs> Lol. No, not awake. Just new warning so much. 22 grand loan for 4.2%. Gulp. Well, get it and get the coaster in. That's a heck of a... $900 a month? You just can't help yourself, can you? You just Dude, have to look gotta, at that interest cover rate. that cost. You just can't even contemplate. If you put that ultra-awesome coaster in, it'll make that in a month. Or not inviting. Right, I'm going to save it because I don't believe him. That is a massive loan. There you go. In writing. Oh. Right, AFK, I'll be right back. All right. I think it was lift off, wasn't it? What if we like build it up here and have people walk up to it? <laughs> 